Good morning guys. It is my first official vlog of 2024. It is Wednesday, January 10th and we actually have a pretty exciting next two days so I'm hoping that this vlog kind of spans those two days. Mariana is here. She is staying with me and she is out sleeping in the living room so I'm gonna be a little bit quiet but today we are going to a premiere actually which is funny i never realized how easy it is to go to a premiere until i moved to la you can quite literally just sign up to be a fan at any premiere and like obviously not everybody gets chosen but the last two times that i've applied i've gotten chosen with my friends so can't be that hard but anyway we're going to the premiere of masters of air i actually have no clue what it's about i don't know anything all i know is that austin butler is in it and that is 99 percent of the reason why we're going aside from that i do have some work i want to do today i'm waiting on some patterns to come in so that i can start on some custom orders because i printed them out on like a bigger piece of paper so that it's easier for me to just cut through it instead of like printing out the printer size paper and like taping it all together so i'm waiting on that i was supposed to come in yesterday and I got delayed to today so I don't know if it's gonna come in like morning midday or night so I'm thinking I'm just gonna do something else today and that is making letter shaped pillows for my friend Liron she has been begging me for these pillows for quite a bit and she finally actually went and got fabric for them so now I have no excuses I've never made letter shaped pillows but I can imagine it's not terribly difficult I'm sure I can figure it out that's what I think we're gonna do today and then premiere later today and then tomorrow we have another little party thing to go to so hopefully i'm able to vlog most of it for you i've been so out of the vlogging loop since vlogmas i really haven't vlogged since then so it's been a nice little break but i also kind of miss it and i miss like editing and i miss like chatting with you guys in my comments so excited to get into it but for now i'm just going to answer some emails and do some computer work before i head into the studio I've printed out these little letters and I added half an inch seam allowance to them and I'm gonna hope for the best. Same with the M. I have a feeling the M is gonna be really annoying to deal with all the little points of it, but this is what we're working with. And then this is the fabric that she got. It's like a little kind of blanket fabric. Pretty thin though, so it's not like terribly fluffy. So I don't think it'll be awful, awful to sew, but it might actually be not the greatest, but we shall see. What I'm thinking is cut out two of each letter and then I'm gonna cut out like a long strip and it's gonna be like the kind of boxing it in. I've never actually made these, but I feel like it can't be terribly difficult. I'm gonna cut it out and then we'll get started on sewing them and then I actually do have pillow filler that Lexi gave me like forever ago but I think I'm also gonna half stuff it with scraps and half like the normal pillow stuffing just to get rid of some scraps as well Done. Look how cute these okay. are. I didn't see it. You're so cute. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> yeah, I'm just so that's chunky. So but it's like cereal. It's really cute. I stuffed them with like half scraps, half actual stuffing. They're like sturdy, but like not too much. Very cute. Here's Mariana. Hi. Your official vlog debut. Oh my uh, gosh. <laughs> I don't know how to act. 
I don't know what else to do today because my patterns aren't here yet and they were supposed to be. But we can maybe go to Joanne's and try and see if we can find the thing for work. Stop. Okay, we have we have an idea. Well, actually, by we, I mean Mariana said this. I have quite a bit of this orange fabric left. And my friend Avery loves the Lorac. So much that so, I know that Avery Yeah, so the much Lorac. that like Mariana's met her like three times and already knows that. Would be kind of silly to make her little Lorac pillow, but I was like, we need yellow like fluff for the mustache because like, you know, that's the, the mo main part of the Lorax. So maybe we're just gonna venture and find some yellow fluff to make a little mustache. But I think that'd be so cute. Like if it's just like a little circle with the mustache. Yeah, 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 you're, yeah. <laughs> Stop. No, we kind of have to. That's adorable. I might make Liran like a tiny one because she hates the Lorax and I just think it'd be silly. And I've never been to like a Joanne's or Michael's. Oh. Because I don't even know where there is one around American here. American thing. We'll see, but maybe that's going to be our venture today. So yeah, that's, that's it. Very cute. that aren't here. <laughs> the coquette girlies really came to play. It's all the pink ones too. <laughs> oh my God. Wow, it's a sign. We watched Star Trek this morning. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. Mariana's getting her first in and out. I'm Which so is an excited. LA slash so California excited. staple. I'm so excited. I'm excited I'm for you to try it. It really is truly the best. I mean, I've for like heard. being fast food, it's actually really good. Hi guys, welcome to the Metbong. Welcome. Welcome. We went to Joanne's and we went thrifting. We did. A little bit. Yeah. We looked more than we like went thrifting. We yeah. just looked at the trinkets. We did. There was cute little, was really cute little cute. things. It was really cute. I can't wait. I got a cheeseburger with fries and a Dr. Pepper. Oh, a Dr. Pepper. I love Dr. Pepper. She's she's a cutie. She's Dr. Good. Pepper over cherry coke any day. You know, I do agree with that, I think. I mean. Yeah, no, I think I do agree with that statement. Mm -mm. I like this little camera setup. Vlogs are so fun. I like this like format. Yeah, <laughs> I like no, it's so it. much, so much nicer. It's so much nicer. I Ooh. love a. Oh, <laughs> the camera loves me. No, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> gosh, that's such a cool setup actually for the camera. Thank you. Oh my gosh. My car came just like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it actually is very convenient car. that it just has that like, yeah, no, like flat top. Because usually they're just like she's prepared, you know? guys. But you don't see the behind the scenes, but this girl is prepared. Wait, let me get ready to pay. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is first. You know. <laughs> can, you can you smell, smell it, it from here? <laughs> can you smell it? Like a nice whiff. Oh, are you having fun? Are you referring to Dr. Pepper? Yes. It's going to be 925. 925. So, yeah. Less than a $10 bill. I'm telling you, it's, it's so like some of the cheapest food you can get in LA. It's so <laughs> cheapest food I have gotten in LA. Yeah, no, literally. Oh my gosh, and it's about to be the best. Oh, oh window. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. The coins. Oh, you target. Oh, you red tape. I'm actually ecstatic. Thank you. Do you want ketchup? Uh, yes, please. Yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we got it. We got the guns. Yay! Sitting down. I'm Official. Trapped. Official I'm taste so test. Sweet. She is ready. Look at her. <laughs> <laughs> Unboxing. Unboxing. What did we get? We got. We got some fries. Wow, they loaded those. Those are beautiful. Yeah, stunning, gorgeous, and mm. the star and of the show. A cheeseburger. Mmm. Well, you look at that. You look at that. Look at her. Oh my God, she looks so like. She looks like an emoji. Um, that's an emoji yeah, burger. Yeah. That's an emoji burger if I've ever seen one. Big reveal. We must bite into it. And I got it with onions. 
Good. Oh my god, taste test. Mm-hmm. 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 That's really good. Yeah. That's really good. Wow, she's an LA girly now. Wow. Wow. Yeah. wow. This was the ceremony. That was it, actually. Yeah, that was the induction. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're gonna get back to work. And by that, I mean making the Lorax. So here's all the leftover fabric we had from the other things. And then this is the one I got, which is just like a yellow fleece. So I can like stuff it into the mustache shape. I think I'm gonna make Avery like a relatively like bigger one. And then Liron and Jade, I'm gonna make them little tiny ones because our group chat is called Let It Grow because we talk about the Lorax all the time. Well, more like Avery talks about it. They're obsessed. And we, it's now just a running joke. So, so now we're gonna make it. <laughs> It's not gonna be anything crazy. I'm thinking literally just like a little egg shape kind of moment with a stuffed little mustache. It's gonna be so cute. I don't know when I'm gonna see them next, but hopefully soon so I can uh, surprise them with them. <laughs> kind of fun. <laughs> Okay, we just finished. Here is our big one. It's so cute. I put my little little teeny tiny tag on them so they are branded. And then here are the little ones. I'm obsessed. I think they're so cute. Look at them. So anyway, that's what we just did. It's three o'clock right now. It's kind of early, so I don't have time we're going to the premiere, but we still have some, some downtime right now. Still waiting for my patterns to come in. They haven't. My fabric did though, if it's what I think it is. I'm still waiting on some of my patterns. I've realized that my Better Than Revenge Girls pattern is a really good one for a base for a lot of them. So I'm kind of using that one and then my bodysuit one I also got printed a couple of times for a couple of rep bodysuits I have to make. Speaking of, this is the rep bodysuit fabric. I'll update you guys later depending on what we do. We're currently watching Jonas, the Disney Channel TV show. What a great time. We got um, prime seating at literally the front row. So we are hoping that they do a little panel or whatever right here and I can touch them right here. That's what we want. We are here. We've got our Diet Coke yeah. and our popcorn. Front row. <laughs> They're gonna be right there. Yeah, there. Where is she? iPhone 15 Pro, Zoom, do your thing.
hard at work today. I have another reputation romper to make. I've made a couple of like bodysuits, but I made one romper, this one, and I got an order from someone wanting the same thing, just wanting it a romper so it's a little bit more full coverage. So I am making it, which like now that I've made quite a few of these, I feel like I've gotten so much quicker at like aligning everything because this specific fabric has a whole geometric print and for it to align like perfectly at all points you really have to like think it through but i feel like my process has gotten shorter which is good like i feel like i'm moving along a little quicker so that is what we're making today this one's actually for january 20th so it's like a very quick one but i told her i would take it on anyway like it was a very quick like she maybe reached out to me a month ago or a little less than that quick turnaround but I love a challenge and I will take any order I get. That is what we are working on today. Later today we have another like premiere thing to go to. Don't know why it's the week of premieres apparently, but we have that. So I'm trying to get as much work as I can done throughout the day today since tonight we also have another event to go to, but it's been an eventful couple of days apparently. Last night's premiere was really cool actually. Not that I didn't think it would be cool, but I knew that I wouldn't particularly be into like a war TV show just because that's not particularly my cup of tea, but I guess I didn't like put two and two together of like, it was produced by Amblin, which is Steven Spielberg's company, which one of my friends works for, which is why I knew of this premiere. But I didn't put two and two together that if like she would be there because she works for him, that he would also be there. So he like showed up and did a little speech and Tom Hanks was also there because I guess he was a I think a co-producer of it it was so cool to see both of them like speak about it and just seeing them both in person I was front row which was really really cool they are such like iconic legends in the film space so I think that was just like crazy like starstruck moment also saw Barry Keegan who I'm recently obsessed with after watching Saltbird so that was really fun obviously Austin Butler was also there I'm not particularly like crazy about him in the way that a lot of people are but he was there and yeah it was a cool little premiere it's so funny how you can so easily just go to a premiere in LA like and just sign up to like get a ticket and it's really like easy I feel like nobody knows that unless you live in LA but it is actually really easy to attend premieres unless it's some crazy big one then maybe it's harder to get a ticket but I've been able to get a ticket to the ones that I've wanted to go to and my friends have gotten tickets to like bigger ones too so really not that hard anyway I'm going to continue working on this I believe I don't have the lining fabric for this yet but I'm gonna put together the outer shell and then I'm gonna pat it my mannequin to the size to make sure that everything fits right and then once I get the lining I can actually just like finish it up should be pretty quick to finish I'm hoping to finish that within like today tomorrow Saturday at the latest depending on like when the fabric comes but also TBD we'll see that is what we're working on okay change of plans I didn't realize how late it was already it's like 11 45 so I'm gonna just start making lunch and then afterwards I will get back to the sewing romper obviously there's no lining in it right now so it's just see-through but this is essentially what it looks like honestly listen i've gotten so good at lining everything up it looks like there aren't any seams on it but there are indeed like seams right here in the middle all the things so i'm proud of myself for it but i have a minor adjustment here at the shoulders that i'm gonna like kind of take it in a little bit other than that it fits really well it's a good good fit i'm just gonna wait on the lining to come in which i think it should come in soon but i don't really have much else i can do to this in the meantime but i have some computer to work to do for one of my part-time jobs so i think i'm gonna do that and honestly i need to edit this vlog too so i can probably start editing yesterday's footage already so that then i only have to add this today's footage in it and then it's kind of done for either saturday or tuesday i'm trying to debate if i want to upload on saturday and do like my twice a week or on tuesday because i don't have anything planned for tuesday i don't know realistically what i'm going to be able to film this weekend if i'm going to be able to film anything this weekend so i don't know that's a me thing i'll figure it out but i love this fabric love reputation love this bodysuit and can't wait to hopefully get more reputation outfits when reputation taylor's version comes out because it truly is my favorite era for like outfits and all of that and we desperately need more outfits so i'm really excited for that hopefully soon that is it for now <laughs>
It's called Tell Me Mode. It's a fashion TV series about the history of fashion. We got the gun. Wow. We just got back. We did not get a single actual picture besides our red carpet pictures that I don't know if we're ever going to actually see. But here's proof oh, that we, we did indeed look good. No, no, wait, 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 we do have proof. Oh, wait, you we got the do, airdrop we wand. Do. You're so right. Wow. 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 Here's our proof. I didn't take a, we I never get ready, so I just, need, I needed, we I needed a moment for you to see that I do indeed get dressed. That is it for today's vlog. Thank you all for watching. Bye. Bye.